Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be making like a speed detector, which will detect anytime your phone, anytime you shake your phone, and if you trigger an event in your flipper app. And we'll be using the shake package which I've installed, which I've added to my dependencies right here. I'll leave the link in the description below. And without wasting time, if you're new here, can you subscribe to the channel? Also like this video and without wasting time, let's get started. So as you can see here, we have the demo flutter code here. I'm not changing a lot. I've just removed the comments. And it works the way it is supposed to work right here. So this is just the main code you get where you create the new flutter app. So let's change that. So right here, I'll create an init function. Right here, okay. We already have an edit function here, so I'll put in my shape detector. So detector dot auto start is when it to start automatically. So right here, and inside there, I'll put my increment counter function because so I want to increment the counter anytime I shake. My phone. All right, nice. So let me restart. This is actually very easy to do. And now, if I go into my app and I shake my phone, right now I'm shaking my phone. I'm not pressing the button here. I'm shaking my phone, and you can see it is increasing. So let's say you don't want the shake to start automatically you want to start it by yourself let's come here so i'll put a loop shape detector and i'll call it shape and then let me delete this so shape equals to shape detector that wait for start so we have the same function we have right here to increase the inc the time the counter I mean increase the counter so here in my floating action button floating action button is the button we have down here the one right here so there I will have my shape function the function to start the shape we have shape dot Start listening. So you can see shape the start listening and shape the stop listening. Shape the start listening is to start the timer and shape the stop listening is to stop the shape. So I need to restart it so that the next function will be initialized. So okay, as we started, now if I shake my device, nothing is happening. But if I press this button right here, I okay, see, and I shake it, now the shake is being registered in the app. The shake is now being registered in the app. So this is a very simple method to detect when your phone has been shaked, when you shake your phone, and you want to trigger an event in your flutter app. Also, this kind of stuff can be used to create a, a step counter. Because when you work, you shake your body, you shake your phone, so you can use this function to also create like a step counter. And the shape function has some other things that you can add to it. For example, here we have the shape threshold, we have the shape slip time, the shape count to step time, and the minimum shape count. Like once you shake, how many shape do you want to, to count for? So because here it is set to one, so then we shake it once when it triggers the increment counter so guys this is a simple way to create a skill detector app if you are new yet please subscribe also like this video and i'll see you in the next lesson okay we also be available in the description below